Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to make this 3D cube with a star inside it on scratch and I am going to show you how it works. So, it's a cube with a star inside it. You can make anything like a car, a house, anything. Now, let's make it. First, we need two variables which are x and y. I delete this variable now. x and y. These two variables are for the rotation of our cube or any 3D object we are making. So now I'll just hide it now. Okay. So now we need to like make a block so it should be go to x then add this input x then y y input x z and a z input and also click run without screen refresh and click ok so the x and y are for the horizontal and the z is for the vertical so now let's add a go to block in it and now we are going to take a multiply block inside a minus block and now let's add the cos cos of cos of x and this x input from that block and now duplicate this whole thing not the minus thing the minus thing. And it should be x here. Only thing you need to change is this x to y, not the variable, the input. Now put it back. Now let's put it here. Now for the y, make this little small so that we get more space. So now let's add and multiply block. Here now let's add a cos cos of wait I forgot to change this to sign yeah now this I change it to y now in the other one you just need to like add an x I mean y only here and then you need to add a y from here I mean not here actually you have to like then add an this block and then you have to duplicate this and then put it here change it to x and then you have to add this. Not there. I have to add another of this. Put this here. And add that there. Now put it back. Now I'll duplicate this. And put it here for. And I'll now change this to sign of y and add a z input from there to here. Now let's put it back. So with this you can make a 3D object. Now let's make the cube. So now let's go to the side here and also 
let's just take a green flag option and forever the the uh, cube should spin according to the uh, according to the mouse so what i have to do is set the x and y the x and y variables so set x to mouse x and the y to mouse y so this is just simply make the cube like point towards the mouse wherever it goes let's make this sprite a smaller oh, so let's delete the whole cat and then simply make a dot that dot and now let's make the cube so now when the green flag is clicked let's take our new block with a pen up here with a pen up. and also you need to keep it in a forever block and let's add wait let me go to take the extension here the pen extension now there is all the pen the pen down I mean the pen up yeah the pen up now let's make this go 50 50 and just leave this 50 this is at the corner of the side here so you just go there and it will be in pen up okay i want it to be pen up at the first then it should be pen down then let's take the block again and now insert 50 and now now it's you have to add minus 50 and the c we put the y minus 50 and now let's add 50 here this will just make a line let's see yeah it made a line and it's going according to the mouse's x and y yeah so now let's duplicate this not this duplicate this pin up and then put that there and after this let's add make this also minus then this also to minus then let's make only this to negative and the other one positive yeah now it made two lines which is not what i wanted so what i have to do is uh, so what i have to do is still like this okay so now let's make this like okay so after it go to that negative place let's change this to my negative 50 and then negative 50 here also and 50 here let's see how this didn't make a line yeah because i get pen up i don't need that pen up yeah then made an L now let's make it come up so I'll duplicate it again then just need to delete this now came up so now we need it to connect this place to here so now let me move this here okay, so now I'll duplicate it again switch it and make it not, not, not negative and here i'll put it negative 50 and that will work i'll just add 50 yeah now you can see we got a square square now we have to make another square at the top of it so what we have to do is just duplicate the whole thing the only thing you need to change is the z which means the whole square will now come up come upward so now minus to all the 50s only in the z minus 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 and 
Okay, add a pen up here so it will not draw that time. Yeah, there. Now we got another square on top. Okay, so now let's make the lines like connect together. So what you have to do is I'll just duplicate both of them, put them like right next to each other so we know which block we are taking. So first, we need to take these two out. I'll put it here. Now take the first two blocks out from this, connect it together. The next also I'll just connect it. And now I'll just add pen up, pen, yeah, pen up, and add this here. So now, after that, I have to add a pen, actually pen down here. Now, I'll take the next block, this, and now put pen up, add the pen up, and then add this, pen down the middle. Let's see how it is. Yeah, you can see that part like that. Yep. Now it's getting a little squished over here. You can see that. I think there's a little mistake in the uh, this area. So in the equation. So yeah, there is a little bit mistake. So what I have to do is I have to change this to an X. And then after that, you have to add an. Uh, you have to add one plus block of the whole thing. Add a plus in the whole thing. Put back. And this thing should not be there. It should be here. And at this place, I will just. Duplicate this and this can be this can be y, this should be x, then this should be sine. Now let's see how it's working. Yeah, now it's now it's better. Now we can see it's very perfect now. Okay, now it's better. Now I'll show you the whole code because you might also make the same mistake. So here I'll just show you the equation. So it's this x in the x part you have to do this, the y you have to do this part. Okay. Now let's continue making the cube. Okay, back here. And now let's take the next pair. Yeah, let's connect these two. And let's take this down here with a pen up and a pen down here. Now let's see how it is. Yeah, one more. Last line. Pen down. I mean pen up. And then add this. Pen down. Now we'll get a complete cube. Let's also make it a little bit more thicker and add a nice color. I'll add the color to the color blue. If you want, you can make it multicolor by changing the, like taking this, putting it in the beginning and just, I mean not in the beginning, just need to put it here and it will just change forever the color. But I want it to be in this color and then I will set the pen size to like 5 there that's more better so now let's make the star inside the cube for that I'll just uh, make the background fully black so that we can see whether it is a white star okay I'll make the star white okay so now so now I'm only gonna add two lines. So
so then you will be able to make the rest so i'll just add two lines a plus sign in the middle so now i duplicate two, two of these to make one line so now i'm not gonna i'm just gonna make it 30 here so minus 30 and 30 we'll start from this corner to we need to make it to this corner so yeah then this z can be zero and here i just need the opposite 30 here and here i'll keep minus 30 are the opposite of this now let's see how the line will be now yeah so you know that oh yeah the mistake is i should change this here to zero i have to change this 50 to zero now yeah it's, it's yeah like that maybe i will put it 50 here and when not completely 50 or maybe i don't need it like that so i just like put add 30 here and then i just so i just not make it from here to here i just make it like straight not diagonal like this so 30 30 like that yeah make it straight but it's not, it should not be like this i'll just set zero here yeah i need to bring it a little bit front so to take it a little bit front i'll just need to delete everything with this and i will come no, it didn't come that much yeah it came so i'll make that one also zero now let me see yeah came in the middle now let's make it from up to down so i'll duplicate it and then up and then pen down and also at the last you need to add a pen up for sure else there will be some glitches like there will be a line connecting the star and the cube you don't need that so just add a pen up at the last so now now just need to put these values in the z so those values will show like in the z so now i'll add that here and zero in this y now let's see how it is yeah that's a plus let's make it white color so where where does it start okay i guess this much code is for that yeah so before this i'll add this set color and change it to white and add this the, the whole thing is changing white so the problem that i have to is that i have to add this thing here now the cube will be blue and that will be white and also let's hide this uh, purple sprite that shows below the star so let's just simply add a hide block at the top and that's it if you like this video please subscribe and click the bell icon